Masters weightlifters, this one's for you. I'm looking at the three common questions that masters weightlifters always ask me. Now remember, masters weightlifting is defined as 35 years old and up. So if you're just finding this sport now, if you're just finding the Olympic lifts now and you're thinking about competing, this video is for you. Let's get right into it. So the first question that seems to come up for new athletes in masters weightlifting is, is starting masters weightlifting, is starting as a, a masters worth it? And and this is always intriguing to me because the correct answer is within you. You need to ask yourself this, not a coach or anybody else. And it really calls up, what are you looking for outside of yourself in this answer, right? What are you looking for in lifting, in the gym? Are you doing this for you or are you doing this for others, right? Now, here's the kicker. Here's my answer every time this is asked is, does Olympic weightlifting call to you? And what I mean by that is, do you find it exciting? Is it fun? Is it intriguing and challenging and holds your interest? Then yes, it makes total sense to start as a master's athlete. You like this. This is for you, not for anybody else. So come on in, welcome, let's have some fun. All right, so the second question is a deep one. Is this Olympic weightlifting enough for your health as you age, right? So if we break that down, is this enough exercise? Is this what you need, right? Now let's break this down. So first question we gotta ask is about your program and where you're getting it from. So number one is, is your program designed to improve your Olympic lifts? Or is your program designed to improve the athlete who wants to use or compete in Olympic weightlifting? They're two separate things. The first one, a program designed for the Olympic lifts is gonna improve your Olympic lifts, period. Stop, right? It puts a lot of imagination that whoever's using this is doing other things on their own to keep themselves in a good place to Olympic lift. And I'll tell you from experience, not a lot of athletes seem to understand that. And this goes for younger athletes, masters alike. Just focusing on the Olympic lifts, snatch, clean, jerk, maybe some strength movements, squats, deadlift, things like those, is not enough to keep you healthy in the long run of using these movements or competing in these movements. You need a program that is designed to benefit the athlete who is Olympic lifting or competing in Olympic lifting. Now this is gonna look like this. It's gonna have snatch, clean, jerk, drills in there to improve those, strength around it to get stronger in those things, but then the strength continues to go. It's not just focused on the Olympic lifts as it seems. It starts to break into other planes of movement. So it's not just your feet next to each other going up and down in a squat. You break into unilateral, some lunges. You break out into different planes of movement, increasing ranges of motion in these different planes of movement while strengthening across that range. Now that is gonna help you for the long run with your health as you age, you will be blown away. Right, so those are the two different things to, to focus on there, keep that in mind. All right, the final question that I hear from masters athletes all the time is, can I really get stronger as I age? And here's the thing, we gotta, we gotta look at two points. One, what is your starting point? Are you a long time athlete who's been in the gym a long time, you're over 35, you've just found the Olympic lifts or Olympic weightlifting as a sport and you wanna get into it? Are you gonna be comparing yourself to your top strength numbers when you were uh, in your 20s and, and looking at that? Is that our starting point? Or are you brand new, right? So first off, we gotta look at our starting point. But that brings up quickly the second question is what is our comparison, right? So if you were a longtime athlete and you had big strength numbers when you were young, and now you're getting into weightlifting, you're getting, maybe you're getting back into it, maybe you had some time off, maybe you don't have any time off and you still have that strength, right? Are you comparing yourself to your biggest numbers overall and you continue aging and you're going like, oh, I'm never getting stronger because I'm not stronger than I was when I was 20. That's silly. That's just silly. You're a different person than you were when you were 20. 
The, the second way we can compare is, am I stronger than I was yesterday? And there are a ton of ways to get stronger than you were yesterday. And that means, yes, you can continue to get stronger as you age and it'll blow you away. And my final point on this question I always remind athletes is the only limit that exists is the limit that we place on ourselves. And I wanna highlight the four minute mile just because it's ubiquitous and everyone knows it, right? Forever they said the four minute mile was impossible. Four minute mile is impossible. Impossible, impossible, your heart explode. But then one day, one person broke it, right? And the second he broke it within a couple months, there were dozens, I think about a dozen to be honest, dozen athletes within a couple months who also broke it. So think about what's going on there, right? You set the limit, so that's up to you. Where do you wanna put your limit? Do you wanna continue getting stronger each day? Or do you wanna look back at your 20s and say, I'll never be stronger than that? Up to you. So my masters weightlifters, welcome. I hope the answer for you is yes. Let's get into weightlifting, let's do it right. Now, here's the thing, I got pretty deep in that programming standpoint. So what do you do? Here's the thing, if you need help implementing a plan to take you wherever you wanna go in your Olympic lifting, within the sport or beyond, reach out on a discovery call. We're gonna get on the phone, we're gonna look at where you've been in your athletic career, where you wanna go with the Olympic lifts, and we can help you come up with a plan to achieve it with a strong body that feels great. Now, if you've made it this far in the video, smash that thumbs up button, it really helps us. Pay it forward to a friend, share it forward, and subscribe, because new videos are coming each week.